Hello, hello, my dear students. Hi, teacher. Hi, how are you? Very good. And you? I'm doing great. Very happy to see you. Very happy to be here once again. Hi, Francisco. Hello, Francisco. Hello, Lisette. How are you? Hello. Well, good evening, everybody. Good evening. How was your weekend? Good evening. Hello, good evening. How was your weekend? What did you do? Stressful. It's stressful, really? Why? Ah, uh, you had to work, so that makes two of us. Me too. <laughs> Me too. I have to I have to work on Saturday and Sunday. Hello, teacher. Hello, Roberto. How are you? Ahorita, teacher, solo le quería comentar que estoy en una reunión okay, laboral, so pero, pero voy, a, voy a estar conectado. Okay. okay, okay, thank you. Ahí no le pregunto. <laughs> okay, very good. Good, good. So, welcome everybody. Uh, did you advance on the... <laughs> we saw everybody on the meeting. Did you have the opportunity to advance in the platform? Yes or no? Yes. Okay, where are you right now? In which module, in which section? Final three section. Okay, you finish uh, the section number three. That's very good. Okay, so today we're going to also go to the platform a little bit. We're going to work on that one and we're going to try to advance a little bit more there. So uh, we can actually see if you have problems or difficulties uh, later on with the next topics, okay? If you continue advancing, don't worry. It is perfect if you continue. It is even better if you continue advancing, okay? So there is no problem on that one. Okay, so in the previous class, what were we studying? Do you remember? What were we studying in the previous class? This. Uh -huh. Very good. Demonstrative pronouns. Demonstrative pronouns. Excellent. We were studying demonstrative pronouns, right? Good. And the demonstrative pronouns for sure are these, that, these, and those, right? Those were the ones that we were studying in the previous session. And we were also studying about what? We studied something else. We studied the demonstrative pronouns and what else? Do you remember that I was showing you objects and you were asking me questions about? Do you remember? Estuvimos estudiando una pregunta específica para cuando vamos de compra. Which one? Which one? Uh -huh. What else? How much? How, how much? much? Very good. How much? When you say, how much is that? How much is this? Right? We were studying that as well that I was showing you different objects and I have here all the objects still, right? Right, I was showing you different objects and we were asking for prices. And I was saying like, which one, this one, that one, right? And I was also helping you to, when you go shopping with the prices, right? We were also studying prices. Well, so I am very, very glad to have the opportunity to see you in another week. So imagine, my God, we are in the middle, almost in the middle uh, of, the, of the classes, right? We are 15 days away. Well, we are two, four, six, eight, ten days, right? Two, four, six, eight, ten days more, and we will finish our module, right? So that's why we need to do or best on the classes. So I am going to share my presentation with all of you. 
So we can start practice and I am very happy that most of you are connected and some of your other friends still are connecting and let's start, right? We're going to start working on the class. I am very happy to be with you, okay. So this is what we were studying in the previous lesson. I'm going to share it for you, right? We were comparing prices and you were saying, how much is this one? How much are those? How much is that one, right? And you were using expressions for the prices like that's reasonable, that's cheap, that's okay. Are you kidding? <laughs> are you kidding? It's like, no, that's too much, right? That's really expensive, right? Those were the questions that we were using. And we were also practicing a little bit of pronunciation when you start shopping. When you say, excuse me, right? Excuse me. You don't say excuse me, right? Or excuse me. You say excuse me, right? That's the pronunciation you use. When you find the perfect object, you say they are perfect for me. They are perfect for me. I like the blue one. When you specify which one do you like. So you say, which one do you like more? Uh, imagine that you have the orange one or the brown one. And you say, ah, I like the brown one more. Or I like the orange one more. So you specify the color for you to make it clear that that is your choice. And the other one that you have, is when it says they are not very attractive, right? They are not very attractive. So in this case, you show that you don't like something. So you say, they are not for me. They are not my size. They are not my favorite. They are not very attractive. So practice with me. And it says, excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. They are perfect. Excuse me. They, they are, are perfect. perfect. I like the blue one. I like, I like, the, blue like the blue one. 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 They are not very attractive. They, they are, are not, they are very, not attractive. very attractive. They are not for me. They, they are, are not, not for, me. for me. They are not my size. They, they are, are not, not my, my size. size. Yes, when you say, okay, I am 32, but with 36, I breathe better, right? Yo soy 32, pero con el 36 respiro bien. <laughs> so they are not for me. So that's, <laughs> yeah, the boys laugh. <laughs> yeah, así dice mi esposa. Yo soy 34, pero con el 36 me quedo mejor, respiro bien. <laughs> so uh, they are not for me. They are not my size or they are not my favorite. Imagine if they give you a gift and you like, for example, I don't know, Nautica perfume. So you say like, ah, this is not my favorite. And they give you a Pino Silvestre one. <laughs> this is not <laughs> my favorite, right? Yeah, or una botita de Leibon, right? This is not for me. Like your father, right, in the past. So we're going to continue practicing the topic a little bit, right? We, I asked you already about what we studied in the previous class. Remember, practice your English as much as possible. Be respectful and polite. Attend all your classes. Keep your cameras active all the time. Work on the platform and keep an act, active and cooperative on the WhatsApp group. Very important to remember it all the time. So, this is very similar to the conversation that we had in uh, the previous class, and we did it before. And I need to see if you remember what we did. Let's say, look at these pens, Rebecca. Which ones? The light blue ones over there, they are nice. What was the next sentence that we use? ¿Cuál era la que usamos después de esta? Ya lo hicimos. Awesome, thank you very much. Mm, the mm. light blue ones over there, they are nice. Yes, but, but I don't really like light blue. Exactly, yes, but I don't really like light blue. 
Well, what about that sweater? It's perfect for you. Which one? Ajá, very good. Ajá, ya vi que se olvidan de mí en el fin de semana. Ni se acordaban que ya la habíamos hecho. Which one? The red one. This red one. Well, I like well, that. I like it. It's very expensive. Oh, how do you know? ¿Cómo lo supieron? Oh my God. <laughs> Yo dándole copia. <laughs> yeah, but it's very expensive, right? It's very expensive. Oh, let me get it for you. It's a present. Oh, oh awesome. Sam. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Yeah, yo necesito un Sam en mi vida. Pero no, yo no tengo eso, amigo. <laughs> oh, Sam, thank you very much. Yeah. Mis amigos me dijeron, sí, vos está caro. <laughs> Vamos al shopping. <laughs> That's what they would say. <laughs> yeah, I, I really like to go. So anyway, <laughs> yeah, so it's perfect for you. Very good. Okay, excellent. Now, here I have a short practice for the questions. And it says, how much is this backpack? It's $31.99. What about the next one? It says bracelets. Los estamos señalando. ¿Cómo sería la pregunta? How much is this bracelet? How much are those? These are those. How much are those bracelets? How much are those bracelets? They are $29. And the shoes? I have them on my hand. How much are those? How much? How much? How much? Aha, uh -huh, but it's plural. How do you say it? This, this, right? This. How much are these shoes? Shoes. They are sixty-four dollars. Yeah. Is that dollar? Sixty-four dollars. And number four. How much is that? Um, How is much is this? No, that. 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 Uh -huh. that. That. Está señalando. How much is that dog? That. And it says. That's my dog. That's my dog. He's not for sale, right? He's not for sale. It's like, sale. hey, that's my dog. And he's not for sale, right? It looks like Kiara. It's like, um, okay. Number one, can you ask me the first question? One, two, and three. How much is this backpack? How much is this backpack? It's $31.99. It's $31.99. The second question. How much are, how much are, how much those, are those bracelets? How much are those bracelets? Bracelets. Bracelets. How much are those bracelets? Bracelets. They are $29. How much are these shoes? shoes. 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 They are sixty-four dollars. How much is that? Much is is the dog? Dog. That's my dog, and he is not for sale. But if you offer a hundred dollars, you can take. It. <laughs> oh, thanks. <laughs> yeah, very good, very good. Students, how much is this backpack? And how much is how much are those bracelets? They are twenty nine dollars. Thirty twenty nine dollars. Oh my god, they are very expensive. How much are those? Are how much are these shoes? They, they are, are sixty-four dollars. Uh, how much is that dog? That's my That's dog. My dog. And not he's for sale. Not he's for sale. Not and he is not for sale. Very good. Let me see, Mister Guillermo. How much is how much is that curtain? Or is a hammock? Es una hammock. Es cortina. It's a curtain. 
Uh, how much is that curtain? Uh, Invent the price. It's not for sale. <laughs> oh. Okay, thank you very much. Miss, Miss Catherine, how much is that calendar? Mm, it is one dollar. <laughs> one dollar, yeah, that's reasonable. Mr. Mario Barahona, how much are those headphones? The, the microphone. <laughs> Uh-huh. <laughs> no, we cannot listen to it. See, I'm mute. They are $21. <laughs> $21. Well, that, they are cheap. That's very <laughs> Miss Heidi, how much is that picture frame? The picture frame that you have behind. They are $100. $100? Uh, yes. Well, I, I will come back later. <laughs> they are very expensive. <laughs> Let me see. Uh, where are you? Miss Jocelyn, how much is that refrigerator? Uh, uh, it's um, $100. $100? Give it to me. It's very cheap. <laughs> that's, hey, that's an offer. That's an offer. <laughs> yes. Yes. Mr. Jonathan, how much are those glasses? These is the... They are? They are, they are... They are... $300. Eh, eh, I think I can see very well. Thank you very much. That's very expensive. Mr. Black no, <laughs> Yes. <laughs> is that your final price? Miss Carolina, how much are those blouses? The microphone, sweetie, I cannot listen. Can repeat to this. How much are those blouses? The ones that you have there behind. Las que tienes ahí atrás de ti. The blouses. The, the ones that are there, hang it. La blusas, how much are they? Seria, how, como they, la, are, they, they are? They are, and you give me the price. One dollar, two dollars, fifty, one hundred, I don't know. They are blues, blues. Hmm. Five dollars. Five dollars, hey, they look very <laughs> nice. Very good. So those are some examples of questions that you can make with how much. And uh, in this case, it will depend on the singular or the plural forms that you are asking for. Because if you can see, I was asking the question when you say, how much are these? How much are those? And in this case, you don't use the noun again. So you say, how much? And I'm going to write it here. How much? I'm going to use the example of the glass. How much are those glasses? And on the answer, you don't say eh, they, the glasses are. No, you say only they are. And you give me the price. $300, said Jonathan. How much are those glasses? They are $300. Because if you say they, the glasses are, Estamos usando dos nouns y eso no es correcto. Okay, so uh, you only use it they if they are plural and it is if it is singular. Okay, for the answer. And let's go with the next exercise that I have here. And I have three conversations and it says, well, this one, it's only one. Good afternoon. Oh, hi. How much is this watch? It's $195. And how much is that? One. 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 Uh -huh. one. Por qué no ones? It's singular. Exactly it's singular. like that, because it's singular, right? And how much is that one? And in this one? It is. 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 How much? It's 
$255. Oh, really? Well, thanks anyway. <laughs> That's another polite form to say that you don't want to spend your money there. So, um, oh, good afternoon. <laughs> good afternoon. Oh, hi. Watch. Um, it's $195. And, and how much, much is that one? It's 255 Oh, really? Oh, really? No, oh, really? Okay. Okay. Anyway. anyway. Thank you. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> because I don't have the money, right? So the good afternoon is the polite form that you have to introduce the conversation, right? Here in El Salvador, we say, Buenas. <laughs> yeah, when you go to the store, when you go to the store, that's very common, right? Yang. Uh -huh. No, and that's the answer. It's so like, buenas, and say like, Yang. No, buhan. And they never attend you, right? It, it happens everywhere. It happens everywhere. And then you say like, ay, que caro, gracias. Bye. And then you just leave. Okay. So another polite way you say, well, thanks anyway. It's like, Ay, gracias de todas maneras. I'm not taking anything. I have another one. And it says, excuse me, how much are us? Us. Jeans. Jeans. Very good. Because jeans is plural. How much are those jeans? They are. They are only $59. And how much is this sweater? Which one? Which one? They are all different. One. I like this green one. 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 This green one because it's only one. Uh huh. It is. It, it is. It's it's thirty four dollars. Well, that's not bad. Well, in this one, you agree with the price. You say, well, that's not bad, right? and you can take it. Um, hello, everybody. Excuse me. How much are those jeans? They are only 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 eight dollars. Eight dollars. How much is this sweater? Which one? Which, Which one? one? Yeah, different. 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 Mm, I like this green one. It's, it's four dollars. Well, that's not bad. I am taking it. Very good. And the last conversation that I have to practice. I like uh -huh. those. 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 those because you have sunglasses okay. i like those which sunglasses one? over there which one which one one, one. 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 small brown one one one, one. one. very good they are they are expensive it's like imagine if you go to the dollar store two dollars <laughs> roy boy <laughs> supermarket <laughs> to the supermarket right to the supermarket <laughs> roy boy <laughs> <laughs> and they are eh, claro que sí mi amor tu mamá es bien responsable ya ves cuando aparecen delitos a la paz no, no, so it's like, no, don't enter to the class. Yeah, enter with teacher Nati, poor teacher Nati. Oh, enter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's that? Ah, that's very good. Ah, si no, siéntela ahí a la par. Que repita. Okay. I like those sunglasses over there. Which ones? Which ones? Which ones? The small brown ones. 
they are one hundred ninety-nine dollars. Oh, they are expensive. Thank you. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> because they are very expensive. Right? So here we have different materials that the objects are made of. For example, we have cotton. Do you know what's the meaning of cotton? Cotton. Yeah, like cotton candy. Socks. Algodon. Cotton candy. Do you know what mm. cotton candy is? The one that Algodon you eat. Algodon de Si lo presiona, se hace como así. <laughs> cotton candy. Okay, but cotton in this case is the material. Rubber. Do you know what rubber is? Rubber. Caucho. Mm. Oh, Caucho. Ule, right? Ule. Gold. But. Oro. 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 Silk. Seda. 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 Leather. Cuero. 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 Right? Cuero. Silver. Plata. 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 Plastic. 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 And wool. Lana. 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 Right? So in this case, what picture do you have that represents cotton? Socks. No, 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 no. Shirt. Shirt. Okay, and it is shirt. Shirt. No, shirt. Shirt. Si decimos shirt, aquí me pega el machete. Say shirt. Shirt. Cotton shirt. Shirt. Cotton shirt. Good. Let me see. What about rubber? The rubber boots, right? Rubber boots. Rubber boots. Very good. What about gold? Ring. Ring. Gold ring. Ring. Gold ring. What about silk? Tie. Silk. A silk tie. Very good. A silk tie. Right. What about leather? Jacket. Jacket. A leather jacket. A leather jacket. Good, very good. What about the next one? Silver. Earring. Earring. Silver earring. Silver earring. And what about plastic? Bracelet. A plastic bracelet. 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 And the last one, wool. Socks. Wool socks. Wool socks. Now, I am going to give you. Le puedo dar. Un minuto, un minuto, para que vayan y consigan algo de dos de los materiales que les he presentado. Vayan a conseguir algo ahí en su casa, de dos materiales que están ahí presentes. Go, go, go. Vamos. Vayan a buscar dos, dos cosas. Two things. Ready. 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 Oh. I am back. <laughs> uh huh. Listen. Did you find them? I yeah. have. I have, I have a leather jacket. I have a leather jacket and a silver necklace. What do you have? I have a plastic glasses uh -huh. and a, a silver ring. Plastic glasses and a silver ring. Very good, very good. Uh, what else? Plastic bottle. A plastic bottle? And gold ring. Hey, and a gold ring. Very nice. What a else? Plastic hey. toys. A plastic toy? No sé cómo se dice gorro. A hat. That's hat. Wool hat. And a wool hat. Very good. Let me see the next ones. I have ring, um, cigarette lighter. Okay. Layer. But the, the ring, what material is it? Uh, is uh, gold. Uh -huh. So it has a gold ring and 
a plastic and lighter. Plastic stick lighter. Lighter. Very good. Very good. Jocelyn. I have a uh, silver uh, rings uh -huh. and a uh, plastic uh, glass. Very good. Heidi. Wool sock. Wool socks. Very good. <laughs> <laughs> and gold ring a gold ring okay oh but that is a, a bracelet no yes ah so it's a gold bracelet a gold bracelet, bracelet. Oh. very good very good let me see eric what do you have the microphone's ready yes el secreto de la felicidad Eric, tu micrófono. <laughs> <laughs> tu micrófono, Eric. No te lo puedo decir. Hello. Hey, rubber boots. Rubber boots? Okay. <laughs> uh, silk tie. Very good. A rubber boot and a silk tie. Very good. Kelia. Uh, I have uh, plastic sandals. A plastic sandal. Okay, el esposo con una chancla ahorita, no. Ya se la va a regresar así. El poder de la chancla. And why I can't say this. Towel. A uh, towel color. Ah, primero va el material y después el, el, el objeto. A uh, color towel. Very good job. Mr. Guillermo, what do you have? Uh, sorry, I had a silver bracelet and bracelet. a gold ring. Bracelet. Another level. <laughs> a <laughs> silver bracelet. Right? Yo no right. corrí, ya los right. andaba puesto. Very good. Carolina. I have a plastic bracelet. 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 Mm. I have gold sock. Wool socks, <laughs> right? Well, there you go. There you go. Wool socks. Excellent. Let me see. Who am I missing? Mr. Francisco, did you show me your objects? Uh, I have a gold ring. Uh huh. And a rubber boot. And rubber boots. Hey! Alguien ahí se quedó sin bota. Dame la bota. <laughs> Me está pidiendo la teacher <laughs> Yeah, let me see. Angela, what do you have? I have a leather jacket. Way exactly like me. <laughs> and a plastic toy. And a plastic toy. Hey, a bitch. <laughs> Very good. Let me see. Uh, who else? Who else? Mr. Marlon Barrientos, what do you have? Uh, I have a plastic pencil. A plastic pen? Pen and a, a, a cotton sweater. A cotton sweater, very good. Monica Escobar, what do you have? Okay, cool top. Wool socks. Hey, hey, silver earrings, very good. Mr. Alfredo Guillén, what do you have? I have um, wool gloves. Uh -huh. And I have plastic bottle. A plastic bottle, right? Sorry for the commercial music. <laughs> Lizette Castillo, what do you have? I have a uh, Silver spoon uh -huh. and a plastic bracelet. Okay, very good. A silver spoon and a plastic bracelet. Rebecca Pereira, what do you have? I have a, a plastic pen and a cotton shirt. A cotton shirt, good. Uh, who am I missing? Amanda, what do you have? Uh, I'm Hello. Hello. Uh, excuse me, teacher. What objects do you have? What objects did you get? 
Um, I'm sorry, teacher, but I'm just um, um, arriving. Okay, you are just arriving. Perdonada porque acaba de conectarse. Okay, did I miss anybody? Se me pasó alguien? Me. Catherine, what do you have? <laughs> I had a silver bracelet. Bracelet, bracelet, good. Bracelet, and I had a leather. Le just let, let her send that. Dame la mamá. La teacher la necesita. Yeah. Me sentí como los payasos de las piñatas. Un zapato. Y los papás con el calcetín roto. Very good. Excellent job. Thank you, students. Thank you very much for running and getting your objects. That was very nice. That was the cardio exercise. That was very good. So these are different materials. Remember the material goes first and then the noun, right? A plastic bracelet. If you have a color, you say a yellow plastic bracelet. Right? Light blue, wool socks. But in this case, the important part is the material, right? The material. Repeat with me. Bracelet. 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 Cotton. 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 Silk. Silk. Earrings. 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 Wool socks. Wool socks. Very good. Wool socks. Now, I have here different objects and for sure I have different materials. Can you tell me in which category could you place each of the materials? Each of the objects, sorry. What about the boots? Where would you place them? Plastic. Plastic. Leather. Uh -huh. Plastic. Mm -hmm. Leather. Leather. Mm -hmm. Only in those, right? Wool. Sí. Can you have, yeah, yeah, in some cases you have, for babies, you have wood boots. Wood. Yes, wood boots. Plastic boots, leather boots, but you don't have gold boots or silk boots right? <laughs> or cotton boots. Well, for babies, maybe, right? For babies, maybe. Cotton. What about pants? Uh, leather. Leather. Plastic. Leather. Plastic. Leather. Plastic pants. Plastic. Un poco incómodo. Plastic uh, pants. Cuando los Field. usan los que andan en motocicleta Field. y llueve, usan oh, yeah. esos plásticos. Ah, oh. very good. Very good. <laughs> sí, porque para el diario quizás no. <laughs> no. <laughs> What else? Silk. Silk pants. Yes, like the pajamas. Very good. What yeah. else? Can you have cotton pants? Cotton. Cotton, like yes. the pajamas, right? Very good. San Jack's pajamas were made of cotton. And what about wood? Wool. 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 In the United States, there are mm -hmm. wool pants because it's very, Hi. very cold, right? Very good. Wool. What about the next one? Bracelets? Bracelets. Oh. Oh. Plastic. Leather. Plastic. Leather. 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 Silk. Silk? Mm. No. no, I don't think so. Well, here in El Salvador, we made wool. Right. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Tejidos, así de right? Those are the types hilo. of. Yeah, the hilo. Exactly like that. And they are made of cotton in that case. Right? Very good. What about the ring? Gold. 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 Plastic. 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 Leather. Wool. The wool. Yeah, wool. Yeah, the same that you used to make the bracelet. <laughs> And leather. Have you ever seen leather rings? No. no. All right. I have seen leather bracelets, but rings, no. Mm. Okay. What about the gloves? Cotton. 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 
plastic, leather, leather, plastic, leather, leather. silk, 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 wool, wool, and just that, right? Gold. Mm. <laughs> Maybe I don't mind, right? Maybe. But... <laughs> Oh, en las armaduras eh, oh, usaban ante los caballeros pues. yeah. it was it but nowadays no imagine oh. you in the coaster with a gold glove. bye bye oh. hand <laughs> the next one <laughs> shirts cotton 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 and plastic for the uh, rain, right? For the uh, rain. Uh, sí. Good, very good. What about the jackets? Uh, leather, 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 silk, wool, uh, cotton, 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 plastic, and plastic, plastic for the raincoats. Very good. That is called raincoat. Raincoat. Rain and oh, necklace. Gold, <laughs> I have a little conversation for us. And it says, look, these jackets are really nice. Which one do you prefer? I like the wool one better. The wool one, why? It looks warmer. Well, I like the leather one better. It's more stylish than the wool one. Mm, there's no price tag. Excuse me, how much is this jacket? It's 499. Would you like to try it on? Oh no, that's okay, but thanks anyway. You're welcome. <laughs> right? The price tag is the little card that has the price of an object. That it's the price tag. Right? In many of the cases, you find it like this one here on the bottom, and it has the price, right? That is the price tag. So why? Didn't she buy the leather jacket? Because it's more expensive. It's uh, very expensive. Because it was very expensive, right? How much was the jacket? One hundred ninety-nine. One hundred ninety-nine dollars. Four hundred. Sorry, four hundred. Four hundred ninety-nine dollars. And why did she like the wool one? It's warm. it's, it's looks, warmer. Looks warmer. It looks warmer. Do you know what's the meaning of warmer? Huh? Warmer. Caliente. Caliente. Aha, but warmer, as in as a comparative. Warm is the adjective, right? Caliente. Más caliente. Aha, mm. exactly. Warmer, it is más caliente. Y aquí hacemos el cambio. Cuando los adjetivos les agregamos ER, los usamos en su forma comparativa. Okay. So in this case, when you have here warm, it's caliente. But this one looks warmer, it's más caliente. When you say more stylish, the word more, it's also a comparative. But you use it with longer adjectives. Con los adjetivos que son más largos. Stylish. Exactly. Stylish. It's stylish. It has three syllables. And in this one, you have more. More stylish. And this one, you say, um, which one do you prefer? En esta le damos la opción, right? Which one do you prefer? I like the wool one better. Más. Right? I like the wool one better. Me gusta esta más que la otra. Why? You say it looks warmer. I like the leather one better. Right? This is another form of comparatives. When you say, how much is this jacket? Is the question that we have studied before. Would you like to try it on? No, thanks. Because it's very expensive. You're welcome. So, 
I know that you have studied comparatives before. So we are going to give a very quick view to them. So let's just practice the conversation before we move on. Look, these jackets are really nice. Which one do you prefer? I like the wool. Like the wool. The wool, one. the wool one. Why? It looks it's warmer. 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 Well, I like the leather one better. It's more stylish than the wool one. Mm, oh, there's no price. No Excuse me. How much? How much is this jacket? Um, four hundred ninety-nine. Would you like to try it on? 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 No, thanks. That's okay. But thanks anyway. You're welcome. You're, You're welcome. welcome. Yeah. welcome. Thank you. Bye bye. <laughs> right, because it's very <laughs> expensive. So here is what I was explaining you before, right? The forms of the comparatives. When you say that one is cheaper, right? yeah. cheaper. Yes. I have a question. question In the exercise before. Uh huh. Uh, I'm going right no, now. Uh, uh huh. Uh huh. Dijo que el warmer era se le agregaba el R para hacer eh, el adjetivo comparativo. 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 Pero hay casos que también he visto que se agrega el EST, sería Ajá. warmest. ¿Y ¿Cuál Ajá. es la diferencia? Very good. So you say warmest. This is, ese es el superlativo. En el comparativo tenemos dos opciones. Ok, que yo les digo, por ejemplo, ¿cuál es más bonito? Right, which one is better? Ah, this one is better. Right, tiene dos opciones. Pero si me dicen, this one is the best, es que no hay otro mejor. Este es el top de todos. Es el superlativo, es como la última opción. Ok, Mr. Barahona. Biggest. Biggest, right? More, more. So more you say, yeah, it's not, it's not the restaurant, biggest. right? <laughs> When you say, big... Bigger, sorry, bigger, and biggest. A los comparativos les ponemos también la palabra, right? The biggest. Okay, aquí tenemos big, que es grande. Bigger, más grande. Y the biggest, el más grande. Okay, aquí no hay otra cosa más grande. Okay. For example, if you have, a, if you compare the houses, you say, my house is big. Your house is bigger than my house, but Jonathan's house is the biggest. Dimension. Dimension. <laughs> <laughs> right? So that is the difference. Okay? En este caso tenemos grande, más grande, el más grande. El hey, más grande. En el caso de EST, cuando le agregamos el EST, también le agregamos la palabra the. Right? In this case, the biggest. That right? Is. The biggest. Okay. E EST. Okay. Y también aquí tenemos que tener cuidado porque no a todos solo le agregamos EST. Por ejemplo, tenemos the most beautiful. Oh. Beautiful es un adjetivo largo de más de dos sílabas. Entonces a esto no le podemos poner the beautifulest porque estaría equivocado. Entonces a los adjetivos que son más largos, más grandes de dos sílabas, ponemos most, pero en la forma comparativa sería More beautiful, beautiful, more beautiful than, ok, si lo vamos a comparar con algo. Eh, imagínense que estamos comparando dos gatos, vea. My cat is more beautiful than your cat. Y ahí empieza el pleito de amistad. <laughs> My house is more beautiful than your house. Y ahí ya se separan las amistades. My husband is more handsome than your husband. Y ahí ya no se vuelven a hablar nunca. So... <laughs> <laughs> that is the comparison of this one, right? <laughs> English is easier than Russian, right? And you compare. But uh, Japanese is the most difficult language, okay? So that's the use of the comparatives and the superlatives. Xiomara, le contesté su pregunta? Yes, thank you. Okay, thank you, teacher. very good. 
That's very nice. So it is important to check on the adjective. The most common mistake on everybody. Yo creo que en mis 18 años de docencia lo he oído quizás unas 80 mil veces. Mauricier. No. In the love of God. No. It doesn't exist. Okay. Por aquí no van a pasar los alumnos de Teacher Nati y van a llegar a la vida a decir Mauricier. Por favor. El comparativo es solamente easier. Easier. ¿Por qué? Porque easy mm. es un adjetivo de, de qué? You don't say oh. easy. Right? You say easy. It's only one, one sound. Right? Easy. Easier. Right? Mm -hmm. And when you say, I have heard this one. También he oído esto. Difficulter. <laughs> Por favor, no. <laughs> you say, difficult. You have three, three syllables. You say it's more difficult. Difficult. Okay. I have heard intelligent here. More intelligent. Okay. More <laughs> intelligent. Así que por ahí vamos y espero haberles contestado sus dudas. Let's continue with here. And it says, which one do you prefer? When I give you the option, which one do you prefer? ¿Cuál prefieres? ¿Cuál te gusta más? I prefer the leather one. If I say, for example, which one do you prefer, soccer or baseball? Which one soccer. do you prefer? So you say, I prefer. So I so prefer dogs. soccer. Very good. Soccer. Which one do you prefer, cats or dogs? I prefer dogs. Dog. Cat. <laughs> I prefer dogs, I prefer cats. Which one do you prefer, pink or blue? I, I prefer, prefer blue. 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 Prefer blue. Which ones do you prefer, mixed pupusas or cheese pupusas? Mixed pupusas. I prefer cheese pupusas. I prefer cheese pupusas. Okay. Very good. Which one do you prefer, bread or tortilla? I prefer, I prefer tortilla. Tortilla. Uh, tortilla. Right. <laughs> uh -huh. Which one do you prefer? A taxi or bus? I prefer I motorcycle. Prefer uh, motorcycle. <laughs> car. <laughs> car. <laughs> car. Which one do you prefer? Which one do you prefer? Working or sleeping? I prefer, uh, I prefer sleeping. I prefer, <laughs> I prefer working. You say, okay, I prefer sleeping. Which one do you prefer? Cooking or ordering food? I prefer cooking. I prefer cooking, right? Uh huh. Uh huh. Tick, 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 tick. Hello, Chica Campero. Uh huh. Which one? No which money. one? <laughs> <laughs> Which one do you like better? Which one do you like better? Movies or songs? Movies. I like, I like, I like, I like. Uh, movie. Ah. So in better. this case, you say, I like movies better. I like I songs like better. better. I like songs like better. Like better. better. Or you can say, I like, I like movies better. more. I, so, like I like movies song. I like movies more. 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 Like Which one do more. you prefer? Which one do you prefer? Cleaning or cooking? I prefer, I prefer, prefer cooking. cooking. I prefer cooking. Oh. I prefer cooking better, right? Yeah, que le tocan los trastes, oh my god. Yeah. Mi esposo, pica un tomate, un traste. Pica una cebolla, un traste. Pica no sé qué, un traste. Sí. sí. Y si me estás viendo, amor, sí. Así es. <laughs> so, I like cooking better than I don't like washing the dishes better. So, it's like, no, I like cooking better. Okay. Which one do you like more, cats or dogs? 
I like dogs. I like more. cats. I like, more. Like, I like better. I like cats more or I like cats better. Good. So in this case, here you have what I was explaining with the adjectives, right? It's cheaper than, it's nicer than, it's prettier than, it's bigger than, it's more stylish than, right? In this case, the word than works as que. La chaqueta de cuero es más bonita que la chaqueta de algodón, right? Se ve más grande que the other one. It's more stylish than, se ve más estilizada que the sweater, for example. And here you have, that one is cheaper than the wool one. Esa es más barata que la de lana. This one is nicer than, es más bonita que, nicer than the other one, for example. I am going to send you on the WhatsApp uh, group a list of rules for the comparatives so you can have most of them there. Also in the platform, there are a lot of examples for the adjectives. I am going to show you here just in general how to make it. Adjective plus ER plus done, right? So you have el adjetivo, se le agrega ER y then. Ya les dije que son adjetivos cortos. Small, smaller than, okay? And can you read the example? This dress is a smaller, dress is smaller than, than. than. Smaller than the other one. Smaller than the other one. Very good. And I have here, I am going to show you here. Well, I am going to make it here. Let me, we're going to create some adjectives because, okay, I need to use the other. Okay, so here we are going to create some other adjectives. Can you give me adjectives that are small? So here we have a small, big. ¿Qué otros ejemplos de adjetivos tenemos que son cortos? Cold. Cold. Far. Easy. Cold. Dry. Cold. Easy. Far. Cold. Dry. Dry. Short. Far. Short, yes, short. Cheap. Cheap. Happy. Happy. Uh -huh. Warm. Warm. Ugly. Ugly. Shy. Shy. Funny. 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 Um. One more. Huh? Far. Far? Oh, we are going to have here. Fat. And? Lazy. 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 Okay, yeah. we're going to leave these ones because they are short adjectives. Here, you. I am going to, sh to change the color here. And I'm going to use here a different color. I cannot change it. So I am going to make it in the next line. So you have smaller, right? You have a smaller. Big, si el adjetivo es consonante, vocal, consonante, como big, en este caso, le hacemos doble consonante, R. And you have, it's bigger, okay? Bigger, porque tenemos consonante, vocal, consonante, hacemos doble consonante, R. Cold, colder, cold, older, easy, easy, ya lo cambiamos hace poco, lo acabamos de aprender, ¿cómo es el comparativo? Easier, 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 easier. aquí, quitamos la Y y agregamos IER, right, easier, tall, no van a decir taller, taller, okay. hay gente que dice taller, and it's taller, dry, Es la misma regla que easy. So you say? Dryer. Dryer. Short. Shorter. Cheaper. Cheaper. Ajá. Y aquí me va a decir, teacher, ¿por qué no le dobla? ¿Por qué no hacemos doble P? Porque no tenemos consonante, vocal, vocal, consonante. Aquí no cabe la regla. So cheaper. Happy es la misma regla de dry. Happier. 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 Warm. Happier. 
Warmer. 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 Ugly? Ugly. Ugly. Vemos en la misma regla de why. Shy? Bien. So you say she's shyer. Shy. Yeah, yeah. In this case, you have, uh, I think it's an exception, so like more shy, it's very common to use it as well. But shyer, it's, it's the correct one. Funnier? Funnier. Exactly. Double consonant ER, right? Butter. And lazy? Lazier. 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 Okay. But tomorrow we are going to continue working with adjectives that are a little bit bigger, a little bit longer, okay? So I am going to send you the rules for the comparative for you to check it for tomorrow's class. Okay. Well, my dear students, have a beautiful night. I am going to see you tomorrow to continue with the topic and with another class. Please finish unit, uh, well, section three and the exams because we are going to check them tomorrow, okay? Vamos a revisar los midterm tests que todo esté listo y completado. Así que si lo pueden trabajar mañana, sería perfecto. Y si ya los terminaron, excelente. Okay? Bye. Have a beautiful night. I will see you tomorrow. Uh, good night, night. Good 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 night.